Have you run into any zoning issues, complaints from the neighbors? I know, I know you've been around for 30 years, so regulations have changed a lot during that time. What can, what can you tell us about that? Um, actually, we're um, blessed to live in the city of Pasadena. Um, they have actually, um, we had the city officials um, seen them the other day, and they credit um, our family to really bringing sustainable it, uh, elements of of what they are trying to strive for in the city to the residents. So, um, you know, we challenge, we, they've worked with us. We've, you know, posed questions to them, hey, you know, what about this, what about that? And they were willing to listen and they developed programs. Now, even the city of Pasadena now offers a rebate program to take out your grass to replace it with uh, edibles or native. They're now um, offering the rebate program where they'll go in and install a laundry to landscape gray water system. They also have a, a rain barrel, composting, free trees to shade and, and give you vegetables. Um, they gave us a rebate on the solar power. Um, they're very progressive. Eight years ago, they put together a 20-point sustainable goal plan for the city of Pasadena. And so um, they're thrilled at what we're doing, and we're um, thrilled to be living here in a city that really uh, appreciates how you know, residents can be more sustainable in a city environment. Tell us about your workshops. What what kind of workshops do you run, and uh, can anybody attend? And how how would you sign up for them? Yeah, anybody can attend. We're hoping to maybe launch some workshops online because we have a lot of fans worldwide. So want to maybe touch and reach them. But um, yeah, anybody can attend. We have you know how how to raise chickens to making your own wine, canning, uh, can kombucha, raising chickens and ducks in the city. Oh, wow. The list is endless. I, they're so, sometimes it's overwhelming. Oh, we, oh yeah, we had bread-making workshops, herbs, herbs, tinctures, native plants. Not only if we give the workshops, we bring in local people to give workshops, too. So we've had from soap-making to spinning to knitting. Yeah, so we have a wide range of, uh, you know, skills, workshops here on the homestead. Thank you.